All right, cool. So what we have is a bag of casings. These are hog casings, and they're packed in a brine. What do we know about a brine? Salt and sugar. Salt and sugar. This one is just a salt water brine. Generally, a brine will have salt and sugar to counteract the strength, right? So this is just salt water so that it preserves it. When you open it, sometimes it will have a very funky smell. Think about where it's coming from, and that kind of answers why it might be a little stanky. So you're going to take this wad of casings out. You're going to first identify, generally they're tied in one uniform bundle by this ring right here. So you want to find that ring first, and they're tied at the top. And you're going to undo that knot and pull the casings out. And the more uniform you do this, the easier it is to deal with the casings. Casings will knot up on you very easily. So you want to do everything you can to prevent that from happening. So see how I'm keeping them? Instead of letting them coil up, I'm taking them like that. Right. Now I'm going to take cold water, and I want to rinse that salt off. Not only is the salt on the exterior, it's also on the interior of the casing. So we're going to give them a good rinse. And in the recipe, it says to rinse them three times. So you're like, what, what does that mean exactly? Well, that's going to be a good question. So you're going to keep them in water. And if ever you're using casings in your establishment, the only thing you do to keep them fresh is just keep changing the salt. So you can put them in a container of water and keep them in your cooler. So you're going to take the casing, you're going to find one, and you're going to open it up like a water balloon on the end. So we open that up so that I can put my fingers in it. And you can see the diameter of the casing, relatively large. And then we're going to put some cold water in there. And you can see it fill up like a balloon. Right, so what we're doing is we're rinsing the brine out of the interior so you can see there's some holes in there. Right, so we're rinsing the brine out of the interior of the casing. So you're going to run that all the way through to get all of the brine out of the interior. Now, what we have here is a knot. And the easiest way to get rid of the knot is you just take your hands and just kind of gently pull it, or not so gently, and that will kind of get your knot undone. And then you can just keep on pulling. And you know you've gotten your knot undone when you are able to. So you're going to keep on running the water through the casing. All right. You're going to do that three times because there's a lot of salt on the interior, and the salt prevents it from sliding off of the horn, which we'll talk about in just a second. All right. So keep on doing that. Once you get it unknotted, it's generally pretty easy. All right, and then the container that you go into, you're also going to put water in that. The trick to successful sausages is lubrication. What is lubrication? So make sure that you hook the sausage on the end of the container, or you won't know what you have.